Today is Tuesday, October 15th, 2019. I'm Isaiah Tucker. Boise has one less country music radio station. We've got details. I'm Patient Lee. In California, students are going to get to sleep more. It's the law. The news is next. The Darkness Haunted House will be held in the green room under NHS Stadium on October 28th, 29th, and 30th from 7 to 10 p.m each evening. $5 unlimited entry and $2 per fast pass. No costumes, please. In addition, there will be pumpkin sales from project graduation outside the stadium, cocoa and baked goods sales, face painting, and a food truck. So don't miss the fall fun. Don't forget to purchase your device insurance by October 31st. This is the only way to be sure you don't get charged if your device ends up with a broken screen or other damage. There will be no school this Friday, October 18th due to, due to teacher work day or the following Friday, October 25th due to a staff comp day for conferences on Wednesday and Thursday nights, October 23rd and 24th. The ASVAB will take place on next Thursday, October 17th and any juniors or seniors interested in joining the military or wanting to take the ASVAB, please sign up with Ms. S in room 652. This Saturday, October 19th, Project Graduation is hosting a scary Halloween movie night in the Little Theater from 7 to 10 p.m. The cost is $3, which will include popcorn, drinks, and candy. The movie will be, the, will be PG-13 rated Lights Out. Sorry, but this is for students in grades 9 through 12 only. There will be adult supervision. Today's activities is Varsity Boys District Soccer Tournament at CUNA, Varsity Girls District Soccer, BPA Social Event at Farmstead Corn Maze at 6 p.m. When you adopt a shelter pet, you discover their unique mix of all kinds of traits. Where did Wiley go? Where's Wiley? Ah, oh, there she is. Pa? Do you remember being an ancient wolf? Do you ever feel the call of the wild? You're a renegade cop, and I'm a con woman with nothing to prove. But together, we could really solve this murder. They're a little bit of a lot of things. But all of them are pure love. Kim Keller. Sit back, grab the remote, and get your teeth cleaned. Today's high is going to be 71 with a low of 33. Well, tomorrow's high is going to be a high of 76 with a low of 49. One less radio station playing country music in Boise this morning, and one more option for dentists to pipe into their offices while yanking teeth. KQFC 97.9 FM flipped formats at 8 a.m. Monday and became Magic 97.9, a soft adult contemporary or AC station. The first few easy rockin' acts played were The Police, Toto, James Arthur, and The Pretenders. Others on the playlist include Simple Minds, Journey, Madonna, The Doobie Brothers, and Earth, Wind and Fire. After decades of country, KQFC's imaging now declares that the magic is in the music. Students in California are rejoicing because they will soon be able to sleep in a little more. California Governor Gavin Newsom signed legislation on Sunday that pushes school start times back under the new law, middle schools will start classes at 8 a.m. or after, while high schools will start classes at 8.30 a.m. or after. Optional early classes will still be allowed. The law applies to public and charter schools, though rural school districts are exempt. The new start times go into effect by July 1st of 2022, or when a school's collective bargaining agreement with its employees expires, whichever is later. Research shows that letting students sleep later improves performance. The SAT word of the day is pious, which means devout or virtuous, holy. You can use it like this. Going to seminary is often the sign of a pious student. That's the news. Thanks for watching. Remember, live, live the, the bulldog, bulldog way. way.